Good morning guys. I have got to get over this fear of vlogging in public because I want to do more out and about vlogs this year. But I've really got the fear. It's been so long. Um, <laughs> it's a beautiful day today. Let me move the camera so I'm not shadowing my face. Um, it is a glorious, sunny, but cold, frosty, icy day. And I'm in King's Cross. I know I'm always here. Um, wow, I just feel like it's more embarrassing now to vlog in public than it was in like 2013 because in 2013 people just thought you were a bit mad whereas now they're like it's one of those influencers <laughs> just so cringe i'm here because i've got an eye appointment at ace and tate um i actually tried on some of their glasses probably about a year ago i did the service where you can order like five glasses to your home you can try them on and send them back and then um I needed to measure my like PB or something in my eye and I couldn't figure out how to do it for ages. Sorry, the sun is like glaring. Um, so I never got around to doing it, but I really need some new glasses. So I've booked an eye test at Ace and Tate and I'm gonna do that this morning and I'm gonna pick some glasses. I think I want the ones with the clear frames. That's the kind of look I'm going for. I feel like it won't be heavy on my face. I'm gonna turn around so the sun's not in your eyes it's in my eyes instead so that's the plan and then i'm also meeting georgia who sometimes helps me shoot reels or photos so georgia often helps me shoot i do a lot of the stuff myself i actually love editing i get like a lot of satisfaction out of editing a video or a reel or something so i do a lot of them myself but often i can't be the person behind the camera and in front of the camera and i also love collaborating with other creative people and me and georgia get together we often create really cool stuff because we can like bounce off each other give each other ideas i don't know if you guys saw the reel i did for great british bake-off where we were like turning things into i was like clicking and turning things into baked goods that was so fun it was like i was putting ideas in she was putting ideas in and i just find it as someone who works on my own i find it really fun occasionally to work with someone else so we have got like the morning in King's Cross and we're going to take some photos, I'm going to make a reel and we've got some really cool ideas and I'm really excited. So I'm meeting her for a coffee now, we're going to make a little plan for the day. Then I'm going for my eye test, I'm going to get my glasses. What's the jewellery brand Astrid and Miu? I think there's a shop here and they do piercings and I really, I've got the itch guys. I want to get a third hole in this ear but I don't think today's the day, I don't think I'm going to have time. But just putting it out there, I've got the itch. It's funny, I don't feel tempted to get any more tattoos. Since having grey, I'm like over tattoos. I don't really, like I used to every two years get the kind of itch to have, get a new one and I just don't get that feeling anymore. But I do want a piercing. The problem is they just never heal well on me. I always get infection every time. So maybe I'll wait a little bit. We're here with Georgia. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we've got coffees. I've got an oat flat white and you've got an oat latte. I do. We're just gonna sit and come up with a bit of a plan. It's the time. We've got about half an hour so till my fine. eye appointment. I really hope that my eyesight has, I only had a test last year, so if my eyesight's got worse since then, that's really bad. Okay, here's Ace and Tate. I'm gonna go in for my eye test. I wonder if they'll let me film it and then try on some glasses. Hopefully I can go somewhere where I can take my mask off to try the glasses because that's kind of complicated. I've been told I can put my mask down to try these on. These are the Pierce Large Medium Fit. What's, what colour are these ones? It's called the brown. Oh, golden brown. I think they're really nice because they're kind of like a very, very light browny pink warm colour. I tried on the clear ones as well, which I really like, but I think these suit me better. The clear ones are cooler though. Put them on, let me show you. These are the clear ones. Oh, I kind of like both. Maybe I need two, one for the car, one for my desk. <laughs> Those are the clear ones. This is the brown ones. Oh, they're so comfortable. You can like hardly feel them on your face. You gently cover your left eye with your left hand for me. C-H-N-L-B. C-H-N-L-B. Blurry. Blurry, that's okay. <laughs> it's the I, anticipation. Uh, yeah, exactly that. Eye test done. Good news is my eyesight hasn't changed in a year. Um, I haven't ordered my glasses yet because we are running out of time. So I thought we'd get on, crack on, do the reel and stuff that we need to do. And then I'm going to go back and order the glasses. Um, I just put these on, my Ray-Bans, and I couldn't open them. Like I literally felt like I was going to snap the arms off opening them. Um, Georgia seems to think it could be salt water. 
seawater. I couldn't really remember the last time I went in a sea, so I'm not sure. But I think I went away in the summer. I'm just not sure if I went in the sea with my glasses. But anyway, she said, a bit of boiling water on the hinge. Gonna give that a go later because these are my favorite, they're my only sunglasses. I love them um, and they're broken. I managed to prize them open. Is it prize? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> that sounded <laughs> wrong. Anyway, we're almost finished. We're just gonna do the opening clip of the reel. If you guys have already seen it, go give it a like. That'd be great. Um, okay, let's do this. They always have cool pop-up things in the middle of King's Cross. And this is a, what's this called? Like shuffleboard? Did I completely make that up? I don't know if it is because it's not really a board. Oh, it looks fun. Not what we're here for. Not what we are here for. <laughs> okay, we've just come to Granger & Co to kind of look at all the content we just shot, do a bit of entertaining um, before we finish our day and I head home. And obviously, we're gonna get some food. You can start, you don't have to wait. <laughs> don't let your food get cold. Um, yeah, we got some food, obviously. Um, George has never been here and it's one of my faves. I got the raw tuna and avocado pokey. So it's got like brown rice, cherry tomatoes, um, lots of yummy things. Georgia got uh, sweet corn fritters. If you Google Bill Granger sweet corn fritter recipe, there's a recipe. It's very good. I've made it for friends for brunch before. It's delicious. Okay, finished up at Granger and Co. And I'm going to quickly pop into and other stories because I haven't been in there for so long before I head home. Bumped into Jules and Lindsay in Granger and Co. And it was so nice to see them. But I feel like I haven't seen people in so long. 2019 I was all over the place I just had grey wasn't really working much 2020 pandemic hit and feels like it's just been years since I've seen work people done normal sociable things and it's definitely taken me a while to get back into like just being normal and having social conversations <laughs> I know that sounds strange maybe some of you guys are feeling that too in different ways um, it's just been a while it's been like an extra while for me because the year before the pandemic I had, had I just had grey so I feel like I can't really hold a conversation with people when I haven't seen them for a while. Okay I'm home after a really successful productive morning really looking forward to getting my glasses they actually kindly gifted me one pair so I went for the clear ones and then I bought another pair myself because I never wear my glasses because I can never find them so I figure if I just keep a pair in my car I'm going to keep the clear ones in the car and they're going to be my driving glasses and then I got the kind of slightly pinky ones and I'm going to keep those on my desk and they'll be my like computer working reading looking at my phone glasses that's the plan so I'm really excited to get those back I think they said they'll take about a week to 10 days. I've got a load of photos and reels and cool stuff to be getting on with to edit. George is doing some, I'm doing some of the photos and we had a really productive lunch as well, brainstorming some stuff for this year. So I'm really excited for that. Okay, before I end this vlog, I wanna see if I can fix my glasses. So let me show you what I was talking about. These are my Ray-Bans, I love these. But look, I literally, I can't, open them like I can't even explain I have to look they're like bending they really don't look like they want to open they're so so stiff so I'm gonna run some boiling water just over the wait isn't it gonna like crack the glass I'm a bit scared about this she basically said put boiling water over the hinges I'm gonna give that a go I mean I can't break them any further they are really 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 broken so let's see if that works okay let me see what happens I'm literally just pouring it over the hinge. <laughs> this is really scary. I feel like I'm gonna break my glasses. Okay. So if it is like salt water, then this should just like loosen it. Oh, do you know what? I think, I think that's gonna work. Georgia, you're a genius. Thank you. <laughs> right, I'm gonna end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you enjoy all the content coming up from this morning. If you don't already follow me on Instagram, please go follow me, at Lily Pebbles. I really enjoy making content on Instagram at the moment, so I hope you're enjoying it too. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.